All right, another day on the cut. It's day six on the cut. It's back day. I've reverted back to my bro split. So I'm not doing legs and, and back on Tuesdays like I was before. Now I'm just purely doing back. I'm, I'm going back to a bro split. So one muscle per day. I'm doing chest Mondays, back Tuesdays, rest Wednesdays, Thursday shoulders, Fridays arms, Saturday legs, Sunday rest. So I'm back on a bro split rotation. When I'm cutting, I can't really train legs twice a week. I just don't have the energy. So only training legs once a week. Tuesdays is now purely just back. And I'm starting off with snatch grip deadlifts as I always do. I'm doing three sets of eight on snatch grip deadlifts. And I'm staying with the heavy deadlifts for this cut. Stay with that, like I said in yesterday's video, stay with that heavy weight. Don't run away from the heavy weight even when you're cutting. So I'm keeping the same routine pretty much. Just taking legs down to one day a week, one, uh, one session per week. Uh, but yeah, snatch grip deadlifts, keeping those in, staying as strong as possible as I can on snatch grip deadlifts. And I'm doing three sets of eight today. I've done my first set already, it was pretty tough. And on, set, on reps one, four and eight, I'm doing a pause above the knee, a three to five second pause above the, above the knee on the way up on reps one, four and eight. No, mate, no, all yours. And um, yeah, so pause above the knee on reps one, four and eight, three by eight, three to five second pause on those three reps that I just said, which makes it a lot harder. I need to catch my breath. Those are brutal, man. Absolutely brutal. Horrific. Fucking hate them with every fiber of my body. But it's the shit you hate that normally has the most benefit to you. Okay, next exercise is body weight pull ups. I haven't done pull ups, I didn't do it pretty much any pull-ups the entire bulk. I'm still very, very heavy. So these are, these are gonna be very hard. So I'm just working my way back into these. When I get, the more you cut, the easier these get. This is probably one of the only exercises that actually gets easier when you cut. So this is my first week back on pull-ups. I did my first set already, got seven reps. This is my second set. I'm doing about 12 minutes 
see how many reps I can get in 12 minutes. This is my second set. First set, seven reps. Okay, next exercise, one arm dumbbell rows. This cut, I'm gonna do a lot more bodybuilding accessories, a lot more bodybuilding movement. This cut's gonna be a lot more bodybuilding focused. The, the, the bulk was, there was a lot of bodybuilding work, work done in the bulk, but it was very strength focused, a lot of powerlifting work. But this cut is gonna be more streamlined towards bodybuilding. So a lot more bodybuilding based movements. I'm gonna do some heavy one arm dumbbell rows now. I'm gonna do two sets of 10 reps, that's it, each side. Two sets of 10 each side. This is my second set of 10 that I'm about to do now. Those are bloody tough. We're really trying to, I like to do them on an incline bench. And I really try and row them, row my elbow into my pocket when I do them. Try and focus as much on the lats as I can. All right, on to the next exercise. We're doing a traditional lat pull down. Typical lat pull down, three sets of 12 reps. This is an upper back exercises exercise. This is a width exercise. Remember guys, pull downs work your width, rows work thickness. Pull downs width, rows thickness. So this is my second pull down exercise of the workout. This cut, I'm gonna aim for deadlifts, plus two pull down exercises, plus two rows. So five exercises of workout is what I aim for, typically in my typical back routine on this cut. That's what I'm gonna try and aim for. So this is my second pull down movement. I've already, I've already done pull ups. I've done my first set, two more sets of 12. So three sets of 12 in total. Let's go.
try and stay as upright as possible when you do lat pull down. A lot of people lean back, you turn it into a row, you change the exercise completely. Really be strict with it and stay upright. Okay, final exercise, gonna finish with a rowing movement, a V-handle cable row to end the workout. I like how these feel. I'm not a big fan of the typical row handle, the really close grip row handle. Not a fan of it, it's quite, gets on top of your body, I'm not a fan of how that feels. Look. I'm not a fan of this handle. I like the bigger one, the one that's slightly wider open. I feel I get a better contraction with that handle. Play around, there's so many different handles you can use on a row. It's on the cable row, like play, play around with like different handles, see which one you, feels best for you and that connects with your back best. It's all about trial and error, the gym's not a sweet science. Try a variety of different handles and pick the best one. But yeah, I'm gonna finish with three sets of 12 here as well. I've done my first set already, this is my second set. All right, that, all right, that's the workout, guys. Done and dusted, day six on the natural cut. I'm getting leaner by the day. Wait till this cut's finished. I'm gonna be diced. I'm gonna achieve my greatest ever physique, this cut. My best ever physique, this cut, will be achieved. Mark my words. That's the workout though, guys. See you tomorrow. Nick Kajalzi the founder of the Mendez Cartel, the Natty Kink. Subscribe to this channel, follow me on Instagram and TikTok. And as always, long live King Charles III, and God bless Sir Winston Churchill.